gamers, welcome to my boulders. You're not gonna believe this. I managed to get my hands on the KF console. That's right, I got my hands on the KF console and guess what I loaded up? Render 96, basically the only way to possibly play Mario 64 in 4K. So here's how this works. This is just vanilla Mario 64. Not much has changed about it. However, you may have noticed the graphics look much, much better. I'm gonna go ahead and click new and boom, brand new graphics. And what's awesome about these graphics is they're not just super high def, they're not super clean, but they're actually based off of the promotional material that was used to promote Mario 64 back in the day. So everything, and I mean everything, has been repolished. And not only has everything been like retextured and redone, the text is going to look different and a lot cleaner. You can unlock Luigi and Wario, which we're going to get to at some point. There's brand new unused enemies that have been re-added that were discovered last year, like that weird bob -ohm thing in Lethal Lava Land. The Blarg enemies re-added. This is, this is going to be freaking sick. I'm so excited to play this. So, let's see how Mario looks. Of course, we're in beautiful widescreen right now. Mario's looking hella chunky, hella thick. Love my guy. And before we get started, I do kind of just want to show you guys all the customization that is in Render 96. So if we go ahead and go to Options, um, with the game we can change the language just right here on the fly. That is awesome. We can change the camera to be free, analog, mouse look. I'm not going to change this stuff, but the fact that you can do this so easily is awesome. Uh, just controls, display, lots of options for display as well. Full screen, vertical sync. So there's a bunch of things you can do here. With all those options, we're just going to kind of have some fun. We're going to probably do 70 stars, maybe 120 if I'm feeling up for it. And uh, we're just going to have a freaking blast because this game looks goddamn gorgeous. And heck, this video is also rendered in uh, 4K for no reason. It's not going to look any better, but we got to do it just because this looks so goddamn good. Even like the doors, like it's actually insane. So here's the thing with this, um, with this render, with this render, with this game. Um, Render 96 has been around for a little while, but a lot of it wasn't finished, so I waited to play it until basically the whole game was done and some extra stuff was added. Yeah, let's go ahead and just jump into Bob on Battlefield and we'll start doing some stars. Of course, check out Bob on Battlefield. So here's the thing. As I mentioned earlier, you can unlock Chickle. Luigi and Wario. There are basically Luigi keys and Wario coins that we have to find to unlock Luigi and Wario. And they even have different play styles. So will we unlock them today? I don't know. Hard to say, but we can try. Dude, check out those Goombas, though. I love the Goombas in this game. They look pretty sick. The bob actually looking pretty clean as well. Ooh, new sound effect. That's interesting. Of course, the coin. Oh, dude, look at that coin. Oh, so shiny. So magnificent. Oh, my goodness gracious. Looks so good. Let's, uh... Yes, yeah, so that's actually gonna be, like, the main challenge. I will be exploring a little bit. Just to try to find the Luigi keys and the Wario coins. Okay, uh, I guess we'll go to King bob -Ohm. I love the chain chop. <laughs> He doesn't really look scary anymore. He just looks kind of goofy. So something else that is pretty interesting is um, I'm getting rumble in my controller, which, of course, the original Mario 64 did not have. But the Shindo version, the I guess like the the newest patch, right, did have rumble. So it is kind of nice that it's like just added in. There we go. There's the Luigi key. So we found, whoops, we found one Luigi key. Very nice. Okay. Oh, I just, I love looking at this game. Even like the cannons look so neat. I'll never like, you know, hate how the game usually looks. And like, this isn't gonna like, you know, change my opinion on it, but my God, this is one hell of a fresh, one hell of a coat of paint, okay? That's all I gotta say. All right, let's take out the King Baban. Okay, we beat him. He stood no chance against us. And there's there's our uh, a good look at the star as well. We did see one a little bit earlier near Chain Chop, but damn, look at that star. Hella clean. All right, let's do, uh, let's do some foot race. Foot race with, oh, yo, check out Koopa. He is heck it. Oh, okay. Well, his arm could use a little work, but overall, he looks pretty cool. I like how big his head is. He just has a, he has like a super big, big head, which he does in the original, but it's really pronounced here. Okay, so what I think I'm noticing is a lot of like the sound effects are what's like extra loud. I don't know why that is, but anyway, let's go ahead and beat Koopa's ass. All right, Cooper, there you have it. Stat number two. Um, shoot to the island in the sky. You know what? I would. But I'm going to try it the gamer way first. So we'll go ahead and open the cannon in case we fail. But I want to get this the cool way. Okay, so we're going to try the gamer strat once. If we don't get it, oh well. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Alright, very nice. 
Okay, let's go ahead and get one more Bob on Battlefield, and we'll go ahead and check out another level. Ba -ba -ba -da. Okay, you know what? I think I'm actually going to get all, all the stars. Probably not all of them today, but I do think I am going to get all the stars. Just because it's so much fun to look at this game. Go ahead and take out the chomp. Did it. Okay, what do we want to do next? Let's go ahead and do slide. We'll try out the slide next. The door slowly opens. Oh, yeah, so this is one of the few things that's different in this game. Um, when you jump into this pipe, um, you're going to get basically kind of similar to 64DS, where you can play as Luigi and Wario. Also, I gotta say, I love this artwork of these characters. Um, this is the artwork that everyone's been talking about that they want for like a 2D Mario game. Um, and Nintendo will probably never do, which they really, but they really should. So yeah, we're working towards unlocking Luigi and Wario, of course. Let's go ahead and actually do the slide. I have a feeling we might find a key on the slide somewhere. I don't know for certain. So what I think we'll do is we'll go ahead and take the, the shortcut, and um, then we'll just go down slowly just to check. Ooh, there's the key. Okay, key number two. So I guess that's probably it then. We probably won't have to go down the slide, but I'm going to check it anyway, just in case. But first, we got to do the fancy speedrun trick, which actually, this is really easy. Even if you've never sped run a game ever, you could anyone could do that trick. It's not that complicated. Here we go. Here we go. Gamer. All right, cool. So we're done with the slide. Let's check out Womps. This looks like an actual pastel painting. Oh my god, that looks so cool. Damn, that's sick. Okay, so let's check out Womp's Fortress. Okay, so again, we're just gonna kind of explore a little bit on our, for our first star, just to try to find the keys or the Wario coins. I hope they add Waluigi in the future. That'd be a reason to come back and play this, for sure. What the heck? They have purple hands now. Why do they have purple hands? I don't know why. That, that's Okay, that just looks kind of weird. Let's fight this boy. Irv, 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 Irv. Yes, okay. I gotta say, guys, it's so weird playing just... Vanilla Mario 64 on this challenge. Or for this video. Channel! Channel. That's the one I was looking for. The channel. It is very, very weird, I have to say. So what I'm thinking is we might have... Uh, which one is it? I think it's this one? There is the key! Let's go! And the one-up. Very nice. Okay. I'm actually really surprised it was there. I'm not gonna lie. Boom. Easy. Ooh, shoot into the wild blue. Easiest star ever. Oh, we're gonna have to do cannonless, too. We gotta try all the speedrun strats that I know. Alright, let's go ahead and do, uh... uh we'll just do 100 and red coins, why not? Cool. Look at that, look how easy peasy that was. Stat number 10, and stat number 11, if I could grab it. Boom. Okay, fall into the cage island. I'm gonna show you a super fun trick, again, that anyone can do. You don't have to learn owl to skip. Because normally speedrunners are like, oh, yo, I got to do a boom, boom, this, and then like a left. But you see, that's too annoying. We don't like that trick. That trick doesn't work. It does work, but I'm not good at it. So there is a better way to do this. Okay, so we're going to climb up here, do a little bit of this action, just like that. And then we're going to turn the camera to Mario Cam and then just boom, easy, does it, just like that. No problem. All right, let's blast away that damn wall. Damn wall. Where's that damn wall? Hey, we're gonna we'll we'll go for cannonless. We will go for it. We'll see if we can get it. I actually don't know if it's gonna work with uh, this frame rate, but we'll see. It works. Okay, good. <laughs> Glad to see that. Okay, so we are done with course two already. Look how easy that was. Boom. No problem. No questions asked. I have no questions. Do you have a question? Leave a question down below if you want. I don't care. Okay, Jolly Roger Bay. Let's go to the aquarium first. So that's a nice, easy one to do. Okay, so yeah, parts of this is done. It's just like the fish. The fish should definitely be um, changed. Or at, le at least, you know, just retextured to some extent. And that is the secret aquarium. No longer, no longer a secret. Secret's been out, exposed. Let's do some Jolly Roger. Oh, I'm so curious how the eel looks. How does the eel look? Let's go ahead and check that out. Oh my goodness. Yo, look at these rock textures. Okay, these ones look a little weird. Not like bad, but just weird. Um, the clam, okay, the clams have been redone as well. The clams look actually really nice. Yeah, those are pretty clean. Oh, I love that shell. Shell looks good. They still made him derpy, but he is definitely updated. Oh my God, he's actually scarier than before. Can we get it? Huh. Yes, we broke it open. 
Didn't get the ground pound, but we did break it open. Obviously, we can't ground pound out of the water anyway, but... Okay, so I think the last thing we'll do here, at least for now, because honestly, I am probably going to 100% this. Let's go and check out the cave. See how the cave looks. Oh, wait, the key! Oh, the key! Come on, Neil. There we are. I can't see. I have a bad camera. Okay, that's... Honestly, that's fine. We just want the, the key. And can we... Mario. Buddy. There we go. Okay. All right, we'll get the eel star later. That's fine. Ooh, those look pretty good, too. Okay, very nice. Very cool. We should land right on it. Did I miss the hitbox? No, I didn't. <laughs> Me miss a hitbox? <laughs> never. Would never happen. Let's go to uh, Cool Cool Mount. We'll check that out. Ah, this is so much fun to re-explore. Ooh, let's do wing cap. Okay, let's do it. Okay, oh shit. Yo, okay, there's a Wario coin. We found our first Wario coin. Let's get that. I missed it, like an idiot. Okay, so we got our first Wario coin. Oh, oh my god, there's another one right there. No way. Okay. Hold on, it was, it was, it'll hold, it's right there, I told you. You thought I was lying. So, okay, so I guess there can be multiple of, like, the same secret in one stage. Interesting. I, oh, dude, I love these clouds, too. They actually feel like they're in our face. That's so cool. I think that was all the Wario coins. I have not seen any other ones. So here's my here's my assumption. There's going to be two Wario coins in all the caps. Maybe that's how that works. I don't know for certain. But that could be it. Okay, good. So I'm glad we got that. Anyway, let's go and check out Cool Cool Mountain now. Again, okay, let's just appreciate this beautiful pastel picture. Look at... God damn, this looks so nice. All right, let's try out Cool Cool Mountain. I, I love these the snowy trees. They, they seem like extra big, which I'm kind of okay with. Everything looked... <laughs> that is the chunkiest little penguin ever. Oh my gosh, I love him. He's my favorite penguin. So yeah, we'll actually go down the slide normally. We'll do the shortcut route first. I do have to say though, the slide does look very cool. The um, just like the textures look really nice. God damn, I love this art of Tuxy. Can, can we just appreciate this background as well? This it looks like we're in a painting. This is insane. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, let's return the pingy, the pingu. Go ahead to our fun little speed run route, except I'm using the wrong cameras. Okay, we're going backwards, screw it. Didn't quite, I actually don't know why that happened. Do a little bit of that action, and that's it. There we go, I found your chunky little baby. Oh, I didn't mean to land here, but okay. Ba, 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 ba. I do kind of want to cheat, um, just to see what the inside of the cave looks like. I won't do it though. That's what penguins sound like. I've been to Antarctica, believe me. There are lots of snowy boulders in Antarctica. All right, let's go for uh, not a frosty slide. We're gonna do a fun epic strat here where we jump down, pull back, and then I messed that up. Okay, cool, did it. A little bit of this action, boom, look at that. We're even gonna do it the actual way where you wall jump. The Why does the camera do that? <laughs> That's honestly so much harder than just doing a side flip off of this. That's way harder. So let's go ahead and finally fight Bowser. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. We did not get a key here. Okay, we got to look for a key first. Let's do that. Oh, I have an idea where the key might be, actually. Is the key... Yeah. Let's go. I, while we're here, we might as well just get 100 coins and red coins. Why not? We already got the key, and we're already here. So, okay, I guess we'll do that. One eternity later. Okay, then we'll get the 100 coin um, in like three seconds. Just gotta grab this. Look how easy that was. And then we just do a bit of... We gotta do bonk first. Bonking is required. It builds character. And then you go ahead and get the, the star, just like that. And then you finish after that. You just get the coin, you slide down here. Do a bit of that, a jump, and then boom. I am going to die. I'm going to slide off and die, aren't I? <laughs> okay. Okay! We didn't die. We didn't die. I'm happy. Look at those snowmen. Okay, they are adorable. Look at those snowmen. They're so adorable. I love them. Those are my favorite snowmen. Cool. Anyway, we want to go back to first, Bowser. Oh my god. Look at the... Look at this background. It's goddamn gorgeous, dude. I cannot get over how good this game looks. Look at that fire. Even the fire looks pretty good. I'm actually going to explore this as well, just in case there is a key here. I don't think there's going to be keys in this level. I feel like that's only normal levels, but we'll check anyway. 
Crystal's looking sick. The amps look so good as well. Love that electric effect. Okay. <clears throat> so yeah, I just, I can't get over how awesome the background looks. Like, everything else looks good too, but damn, that background is like, I don't know. Really gives off that vibe well. I did not mean to hit that. That's fine though, we'll do a little bit of this action. Do not go in the pipe. Thank you. Well, I mean, we, we explored pretty thoroughly. I did not see um, any sort of key or Wario coin, so I guess that's it. So let's see what Bowser looks like. Because Bowser looks really cool in the promo art, and he, oh my god. He actually looks pretty intimidating. I love, like, the red in his eyes, too. Like, his eyes are really straining out. Like, he's trying to pop his eyes out. Like, ah, I don't know how he even does that. He looks like he's in good shape now, too. He's not so chunky. He looks like he's in really good shape. Also, I love the spikes. The spikes look pretty nice, and so is the key. Very good. So we did it. We did Bowser in the Dark World. It's been done. Congratulations. I don't know why I'm saying congratulations to you. Congratulations for watching this far in the video. You have earned um, the option to now like the video if you have not already. Congratulations on that. Let's go somewhere else. Let's try, uh, let's try outside. Let's do the courtyard. Yo, the classic promo art booze. I love these booze with their hands always sticking up. Oh my goodness. Look at that sky. I love the mansion as well. Mansion looks pretty clean. All right, let's go in. Let's start getting some booze. Whoa. They made this place look so much more like decrepted. Or de decrypted? Yeah, they made it look creepier. Okay, we're gonna take you out, sir. Love the eyeball as well. Eyeball looking hella dope. Okay, now we call out Big Boo. The biggest boo of them all. Besides the other two. They're the same bosses. We don't talk about those ones. All right, let's take the gamer route up. We're not gonna take the stairs. Stairs are for chumps. We don't like the stairs. Okay, we do a bit of this action. Boom. Easy. Don't care. Next. Next, next, next. More big boos. All right, also, you know what's interesting? I never noticed, like, this purpley slash pink eyeball. This is actually so cool. It's like a face. I don't know if it's always been a face on the door, but if so, that's actually really neat. Err. Everything's actually just a thwomp in this game. Every boss is secretly a thwomp. That's just a dead thwomp. That's what boos are. Boos are long forgotten enemies. Anyway, secret of the haunted books. Let's do it. We're going to actually go through the library as well. Okay, library looks pretty much the same. I'm actually a little disappointed. I thought it did look kind of better, but oh well. Okay. We figured out the puzzle. That was a pretty crazy puzzle right there. And boom, look at that. Here we go. All right, so... So we're not going to do too many more here. I think we'll just go ahead and do like star five. But before doing that, I want to explore, try to find the key. If there is the key here. I don't know. Obviously, it'll be a key. I want to see where it is exactly. Oh, there it is. It's right there. Okay. So yeah, let's go ahead and do the big boo balcony star. And then we'll just get the key and we'll be on our way. All right. Hottest, ha, hottest, hardest boss fight in the world. Let's go. And that's it. Boom. Okay. Got ourselves the next key. And assuming I don't fall, which I might because I am slipping like crazy, there we are. Yahahua. You know, let's go ahead and do uh, like Hazy Maze Cave. Oh, what does the, the bunny look like? I'm so curious how the bunny looks. Okay, bunny. What are we feeling? The bunny looks pretty much the same. They kept him pretty faithful, which I kind of like. I think that's fine. Actually, you know what? Let's actually go to Lethal Lava Land because I want to show you guys the new enemies. So, Lethal Lava Land. Um, we'll go ahead and start with this first enemy. This one was completely unused and it was only discovered last year and here it is i don't remember his name i think it's rob ohm and he's basically like a chukya but he's also like a bully at the same time they even got him animating so goddamn cool so let's go ahead and check out the next enemy which are the blargs now the blargs are just these were these we've kind of known about for a while but it's cool to see them back in the game okay so we'll leave them be and uh, yeah you know let's just get red coins for now because it's right here. We might as well. Yeah, I just love that they added those brand new enemies. Like, they, they feel like brand new enemies to the game. But, it, like, it also doesn't. And I guess we'll take out one of the big bullies. Oh, my God. Look at the bullies. They look so cool. They have such big eyeballs. They're like anime bullies. But, anyway, let's go ahead and take out these bullies next. We also still need to find the key, which might be in the volcano. Let me do the cool trick to knock him out. First hit. Boom. Bam. Look at that. All right, let's do some red hot log rolling. No problem. Yo, it looks like you can ride this one. I have to try it. Um, what? What the heck? I don't, okay, I don't think you're supposed to be able to do this. If you can, holy crap, this is so freaking cool. What the heck? 
This is amazing. No! <laughs> Damn it! I don't care. It was worth it. We don't really... Uh, well... Okay, I guess we'll go for 100. We might as well. 100 is really fast in this stage anyway. I'm a freaking idiot. These stupid blargs. Oh, there's the key. Okay, we found it. Okay. All right, well, we'll just grab this real quick. I guess we'll get star six since we're, you know, we, we're really close to it. Also likely to not die. And that's it. So that's Lethal Lava Land. Let's check out uh, Hazy Maze Cave. Let's get ourselves a free Toad Star though real quick. The audio. I can't get over the audio balancing. Oh, wow. Look at that. That inky goo looks really nice. Okay, Hazy Maze. Let's do it. We also got to do Metal Cap. I mean, it's going to be a lot harder to find the uh, key in this level, I feel like, just because it's so much bigger and more vast. I'm dead also. That's not going to help our problems. Oh, you know what? I have an idea of where it might be, actually. It might be near my favorite star. Uh, watch out for falling, for falling boulders. This star is freaking epic. Probably the best star in the entire game by far. Here's what I'm thinking. We're going to go up here. Is the key in this spot? It is not. That would have been a good spot, though. Okay, we'll just grab this while we're looking. Okay, let's go to the Dory area. Actually, what does Dory look like? Oh, Dory looks awesome. They made his eyes extra big. Okay, uh, I mean, I do want to get this star. I'll just get it. Already here. Wait, hold on. I just saw the key. Oh, that was so weird. I think it was in the toxic maze. Okay, well, for now, so now we have an idea of where the key is. I kind of want to go back to that spot just so I can try to, like, pinpoint where it is. Well, I need to get, um, star three anyway, so let's go ahead and do that. There's some bad... Okay, yeah, yeah. So this is definitely in Toxic Maze. Okay. So we know that much. Let's go ahead and... Since we're down here, we'll go ahead and do this star real quick. So we know where the key is. That's good. It's in one of the hallways near the Toxic Maze. What? Okay, that definitely should have worked 100%. Oh, no. Okay. So it's just like... I don't know. Maybe the hitbox is different for some reason. Maybe I was just doing it wrong. That's the more likely reason. Okay, so let's get the key... And then we're going to get Metal Cap. I want to see how awesome Mario looks in Metal. Hmm. So, yeah, we need to go into one of those hallways. Is it... It's going to be either this one up here, or it's going to be um, the other one. I, I couldn't really tell. I think it's in the hallway. It's honestly a little hard to tell. Let me try... Uh, is it here? It's not underneath here. Okay. Um, is it under here? It is not. Okay, I guess we can check up here. I think it's actually in the maze. So I thought it was in the hallway, but I think it's in the maze. All right, well, I guess we'll get the star. Why not? You get stars so fast in the basement. It's actually crazy. There it is. Oh, it's in this spot. Oh, okay. Okay, so it wasn't the toxic maze. So we found that. Very nice. Well, while we're down here, let's go ahead and just get star four. Because it's right here. Well, you can still do this. I mean, obviously you can. It's the same game, just retextured. All right, 40 stars. Okay, so before we leave, let's go ahead and knock out Metal Cap. Hopefully, we'll find two Wario coins as well, if my theory is correct. Oh, hell yeah. Look at that. Looking pretty slick. There's our first Wario coin. And uh, hopefully, there'll be another one close by. Is it in the water, perhaps? Yes, it is. So, okay, I think my the theory is right. We can just get two Wario coins in each bonus level. Okay, grab these. Hope we have enough time for these reds. I'm going really slow, so I don't know. Oh, I think we'll be good. Yeah, there we go. So, I guess if we wanted to unlock Wario, it wouldn't be that difficult. Yeah, basically just do the Vanish Cap and then find the two Wario coins, and that'd be it. For now, though, let's go ahead and check out uh, Shifting Sandland. Wow, look at the sand. The sand actually looks really nice. Oh my goodness, the Pokies. I love the Pokies. I love everything about this heck. Oh, this is so nice, man. All right, let's, we'll just get this star real quick since it's nice and easy. I guess the only thing I would say about the textures is maybe change the color of, like, the quicksand. Because it looks it looks way too similar. Like, yes, you can tell that's quicksand because it's moving. I don't know. Maybe just make it a bit darker. Everything else looks great. We got to go in the pyramid. The pyramid probably has the key. Is it behind me? No. Okay. Doesn't hurt to look. Is it in this corner? Nope. So, yeah, we're just going to check the pyramid pretty thoroughly to find this. This is so much fun, I got to say. Like, I don't usually play Mario 64 this slowly. And it's really nice to not only play it more casually, but it's fun to actually have to find new things, too. Okay. Not, honestly, not much to say. This pyramid is not quite as fancy as I was hoping it would look. It doesn't look bad, but it just looks very basic, I guess. So, no key in here. 
Unless the key is, like, in the quicksand. Maybe it's where, like, the hand fight is, but I'm not certain. We got a key. Uh, anything at all? No. All right, I'm actually stumped. I don't know where it's going to be. Well, I guess that's that. I... I want to find the damn key. Okay, that's all I want to know. I just want to know where it is. All right, well, I guess we'll just grab this. Vanish cap time. Vanish cap looking crisp as hell as well. Oh, wait, I keep forgetting. I need to go for Wario coins. Okay. Okay, there's one. Had a feeling we'd find that. Okay, there's probably one at the end as well, hopefully, because I don't really feel like climbing all the way back up. Okay, and there is the coin right there. Awesome. Okay, yeah, so we'll go to Dire Dire Docks, and uh, we'll find the key. Well, we do have to get one star here just to unlock second Bowser, but otherwise, that'll be it. Wow. This level is not fun still, but it's still, it looks goddamn gorgeous. I kind of like the um, these textures more in this stage compared to Jolly Roger Bane. I don't know why. Let's find that key. Well, and we got to get a couple stars. There's some pretty easy stars here we can get. All right, I am not seeing the key. It's not that big a deal. I don't think I don't think it's in the water. Which honestly would have been too easy if it was in the water. I think they want to make it somewhat challenging. I uh, I straight up don't see it. My only the only thing I can come to a conclusion is that the key is like behind this Bowser gate, which I guess could be it. There's there's definitely potential for that. Oh hell yeah, looking slick. Okay. This stage, I, like, have to play it the speedrun way. I can't play it casually. It's just, like, it's actually way more fun to play this stage the speedrun route. So, here... Oh, something else I just kind of realized. If, uh, if they want to, I feel like they could add Waluigi as another character, but then, like, add, like, Waluigi tokens or something and put them in the Bowser stages, because there's nothing in the Bowser stages right now. Yeah, so I haven't said much about how the stage looks, and that's because we're starting to see a lot of the same textures now that we're playing more of the game. A lot of the textures do kind of repeat themselves, so I won't have as much to say in the later stages. Like this one, yeah, you know, we've already seen lava, we've already seen a lot of these bricks. So that's gonna just kind of happen. I can't get over how, like, nice and fit, like, ba Bowser's been hella lifting, dude. He's got some gains. Not that it matters, because Mario can just do that. No problem. So, now let's see if we can find the key here. For the moment of truth, will there be a key? Uh, nope, I don't see it. Okay, that's done. I did not check the floor that well. Let's keep looking, see if we can find that key. Okay, so I just looked this up. There's apparently only 10 keys um, for, to unlock Luigi. Okay, so I just looked up where one of these keys were in Shifting Sandland, and I don't know if it's still here, because this is an older build that I just looked up. But if it's in this spot, this is so stupid. Just wait and wait and see. If it is actually still in this spot, this is going to be so stupid. Oh my god, there it is. Oh my god, I cannot believe that. Why? <laughs> okay, now there's one more spot. There's actually only 10 keys. Now for this last key, it is actually in the secret aquarium. Again, I just looked this up. And I'm, I don't know why I didn't do this. I should have checked this spot. It is actually fairly obvious. Literally just look up, and uh, it should be up here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. That's all of them. We have officially unlocked Luigi and Wario. So, you know what that means. We got 50 stars, plenty of stars to still get. But next time, on the next video, I don't know if it's going to be tomorrow or next week. I have not decided yet. I have not decided the schedule yet. But next time, we are going to unlock Luigi, and we're going to unlock Wario. And we're going to just use them, and it's going to be awesome. So make sure to stay tuned for that, as that's going to be a great time. And with all that said, thank you all so much for watching. Thanks for hanging out near the boulders. It has been an absolute pleasure. And I'll see you guys next time.